Welcome to Mommy in Chief. I'm Karen Parsons, your host. For this season, we'll be touching upon all things mommy. Moms-to-be, we know you're out there, and so we've decided to dedicate this episode to helping you prepare for your baby's arrival. We have invited Bilen Burhanu, birth doula, to break down the pregnancy journey by trimester. Welcome, Bilen. Thank you for having me. Thank you so much for being here. All right, well, we're gonna be talking about each trimester today. Mm -hmm. We have with us Sheena, who is gonna to talk to us about the first trimester. What are you experiencing a little bit right now? Honestly, a flood of emotions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, nervous, shock, because I recently just found out. Yeah. Um, a lot of physical changes. After conception, your hormone levels, your hormone cocktail is just really, really heavy duty, which is where the nausea and the exhaustion comes in. So that's all very normal. At this stage, well hopefully a little bit before, um, you want to be paying attention to your diet. You want to be making sure that you are taking um, you know, the correct levels of iron and folic acid uh -huh. specifically. Congratulations. Thank so you. So excited Congrats. for you. Super first. excited, yeah. Yes. <laughs> so now we are joined by Alicia, who is here with, uh, you're in your second yes. trimester. Yes, my second. And this is your third child, my right? Third. <laughs> How old are your other children? Five and three. Wow. Oh, wow, <laughs> wow. So this must be this, I mean, this is a great time, the second trimester. You can finally comfortably talk to everybody about the pregnancy right. and hopefully if you had any nausea hopefully it subsided did you have any i had very little nausea my issue was nausea it was hypersalivation oh so that is a lot of people don't know about it that right. we do have or you're constantly you're producing too much saliva yeah. can you tell us a little bit about what you're experiencing as far as like carrying wise um, i'm much bigger as i've seen as a my pregnancies have changed. My, my first, my oh, second, I'm much bigger. My first was huge. My second was huge, I'm sorry. And then this one is, I'm hoping, not going to be as big, but it seems the track record is going in that direction. Do you know if it's a boy or a girl? A girl. You have a girl? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank well, you. The Thank second you. trimester is a um, very important trimester where um, there's a lot of development of the organ systems that were in place during the first trimester. In the second trimester, they basically take full form. Well, thank you so much. Thank, thank you, you for so having me. Okay, so we are speaking with Tamika now, who is in her third trimester. And Tamika, we want to hear all about this. this is your first child? It is. Congratulations. Thank you. It's so exciting. And it's a boy. It is a little boy. How is your third trimester going? How are you feeling? Well, it's funny, you know, I, I hear that uh, morning sickness doesn't last for everyone. For me, it's lasted this entire time. It has? It has, unfortunately. Oh, so, <laughs> so in terms of other feelings, you know, the third trimester, the baby's so active, you know. Yeah. I get a chance to just chill with him every day. I play some music and he'll move. Oh, that's so um, great. We dance together. It's just mm -hmm. a lot of fun. It's, it's a reminder that you're not by yourself. Oh, and my okay. son is, uh, he's very much like my little break dancer right now. <laughs> he likes to, you know, pop and lock on mommy's bladder. So uh, <laughs> it's kind of a cool experience. I, I definitely feel connected to him, which is oh, nice. Oh, that's, that's very mm -hmm. nice. In your third trimester, you're doing all the wonderful things that you should be doing, which is kind of spending time connecting. Are you having any different cravings or anything going on that's different from before? I'm a steak monster right now. <laughs> Every kind of red meat you could possibly imagine, I need to eat. Well, were, you, like, were you eating red meat before? No, the irony is that I really only ate chicken and fish before. Oh, fantastic. Congratulations. Thank you. A special thanks to Belen for being today's pregnancy expert. Be sure to tune in to Mommy and Chief next episode. We're talking about the do's and don'ts of breastfeeding. For more information on today's episode, log on to our website at madamnoir.com slash mommyandchief. Follow us on Twitter at Madame Noir and like us on Facebook. And you can always find me on Twitter at Karen underscore Parsons and at sweetblackberry.org. Thanks.